Hi, and I'm Coach Kemi, CEO of How to Think Global Consulting Empire. And I have been inspired to share something with you about leadership. I want you to read what's written in orange. Empires of the Mind, Lessons to Lead and Succeed in a Knowledge-Based World by Dennis Waitley. Now, the copyright date of this book is 1995. This is 2017. This was written two decades before its time. And I'm going to read something to you from pages 144 to 145. I want to tell you what edition this is so that you would know if, if there's another edition, then you would know which edition I'm writing from. Um, this was reprinted in 1997. So that's the edition I'm reading from. Now it says the title, subtitle of this one is The Global Power Train. Global competition is powered by information access. Information access is powered by technology. Technology is powered by capital investment. Capital investment is powered by profits. Profits are powered by revenues. Revenues are powered by volume and repeat sales. Volume and repeat sales are powered by customer loyalty. Customer loyalty is powered by customer satisfaction. Customer satisfaction is powered by value. Value is powered by employee productivity. Employee productivity is powered by employee loyalty. Employee loyalty is powered by employee satisfaction. Employee satisfaction is powered by the working environment. The working environment is powered by management stewardship. That's the first time I'm hearing those two words together. I love it. And management stewardship is powered by invisible leadership. And invisible leadership is exercising the vision to change the traditional role from commander to coach, from manager to mentor, from director to delegator from one who demands respect to one who facilitates self-respect. And that's what I really want to talk to you about. Um, whatever your position as a female, black, Asian, or minority ethnic individual, female, whatever your rank, your position in your organization, you must exhibit leadership. We know about the leadership of the CEO, the board members, the senior directors, the partners, the senior partners, the VPs, the presidents. We know automatically we look at them and we say leadership, isn't it? Oh, he or she is going to lead. But that is not what you say about yourself. When you're a manager and you have someone you report to, a director or a senior manager, or you are, you are not on that, not even a manager yet, and you're thinking, well, you know, I don't, I don't need to do anything. They leave, you know, they're, they're in charge. They make the choices. They make the decisions. It doesn't work like that. You see, there are many people at the bottom of the pyramid, isn't it? So I'm saying pyramid CEO, you know, board members coming down, directors, senior directors, you know, president, all that coming all the way down <clears throat> to the lowest level or rank in the organization. Whatever level or rank you are, whether you're a mid executive or you're a senior executive in your organization, or even lower than me, you need to display leadership qualities, leadership behavior. That is non-negotiable. And because there's so many people in your position, you are going to be noticed because everyone else is, they're like lemons, so sit down, they sit down, we're gonna do this, this is our project, and they all flow, follow through. But you are looking ahead as a leader. You're looking at when we finish the project, what comes next? What are the, um, uh, um, the potential problems that can occur 
as we work on this project, what little holes and gaps can I fill without being told to fill it? It's not actually my, my job. In fact, maybe as an organization, we just ignore it and we cover it up and fill it up when it shows up. But we, we, we think bottom line, a leader thinks bottom line. A leader takes ownership of not just their, their job, but the company, the organization, as if you owned it. You see, that sets you apart already. Because leaders are looking for other leaders to promote. It's not just about your KPIs. Your, it's not about your KPIs. It's not about your key performance indicators. You know what KPI means. It's about you standing up, head and shoulders above the rest. But that is an attitude. An attitude is a function of thought. So if you are thinking, well, it's just the job, you know, I'm not paid to behave like a director. <laughs> That's thinking, thinking. That is thinking that is sure to keep you where you are, in the position you are. That is thinking that is sure to keep you in the position you are right now. So what I'm going to ask you to do is begin to think like a leader. You're female, you're a BAME female, B-A-M-E, black or an Asian minority ethnic female. You need to begin to think like a leader, whatever your position. No matter how annoyed you are or how long you've been there. Change the way you think and you change the way you think. You change the way you function in your offices. You will be noticed without calling attention. Oh, look here, I'm here. They don't need you to say that. Your work will speak. Your work, your giftings will make room for you. So if you're expecting to go up, then you should be, they, we expect you to go up. Because the leaders, the VPs and the, and the presidents and the partners and senior partners and the members of the board and the um, CEOs and the C-suite level, they are leaders, but they are looking to put leaders in higher positions. They're not just going to promote you. It's not just about skill. You can have all the skill in the world, but no leadership ability. But it's untrue that you do not have leadership ability. Everyone does. You just might need to be helped and to be shown what your leadership ability is. So I hope this has served you and I would like you to send me a message, you know, um, I'll put some, some information down there and let's see how you go and how I can support you to keep being one of the pillars of your organization. I hope this has served you. I am Coach Kemi, CEO and founder of How to Think Global Consulting Empire. Thank you.